Hello and welcome to Infinity. I've been working on this picture of two horses and um, I found a problem here which is that this part of the horse is very bright and this part of the horse is kind of a bit blare, lacking in contrast. So I'd like to increase the contrast here but not over here. Uh, in doing this I've got two layers here. One is the background which has got just the horse on it and the other one is just the horses so let's take that off there we go the horses by themselves we'll leave the the, the back or ground on so you can see the context but we're going to work on just the horse layer here so if we took a normal curves approach and let's bring it up here and so did a standard contrast of the highlights up and the shadows down. So we can make the horse brighter. If you look at this side of the horse here, you can see we can turn this up, which makes this part brighter, but this part here now is kind of burnt out. So what we want to do, let's just reset that, that to the beginning, is hold off on the highlights so we just anchor the curve here by putting a couple of spots onto the curve without dragging it anywhere um let's put one in the middle there if you like oops if it moves you can always kind of drag it back again and anyway we're going to now going to turn this up here and make an s curve here so just watch over here the contrast happening so i turn up here and there we go, there's the side of the horse. We don't going to go too far because it looks kind of out of, out of context. So we we'll turn this up a bit here so it looks just a bit lighter. And then we'll bring the other side down a bit. Doesn't need to be go down quite so far here. And there we go. See that now this side is unaffected and this side is improved. And similarly with this horse here. So what this is, is a short S curve. So we've got the letter S here, but it's only applied to part of the range. Of course we can do this elsewhere in some pictures where the darks are uh, okay and you don't want to change them you can apply the S higher up or you can apply it in the middle with anchoring the top and the bottom. Okay there we go the short S curve. Thank you very much for watching.